Good morning. Happy launch day. Um, you guys, it is um, dreary, rainy, and cold, which is usually like, I usually it's like still like 80 degrees. It was 85 degrees here on Monday, Tuesday. Um, anyway, we have a live today. We've launched. It's Christmas time. We've been playing Christmas music. We have our Christmas tree up. Is anyone on? Is anyone joining us today for the launch? I don't see any comments. Hello, hello. Is anyone there? The comments are working, right? <laughs> I just want to make sure that I can, I can see you and I know that you guys are on. Sarah's checking for me. <laughs> okay, we have you guys, being that it's December, where are we, second? Is it the second? Oh, there you are. Oh, good, I see you. Deborah. hi. <laughs> She's from Canada. There they all are. Lindsay, good morning. Karen from Arizona. Debbie's, oh my gosh, okay, you're all, you're all coming in. Sarah's here. Um, it's warm in Georgia. Debbie, I'm watching Texas play Georgia in the NCAA volleyball game tonight. So Georgia came to mind. Um, good morning, you all are on. Okay, um, we have, yes, <laughs> there was like, I'm spent on the sales. We had, I hope you had a fabulous thing, things. We have Thanksgiving. We had a great Thanksgiving holiday, Black Friday. Cyber Monday, we have a sale going on right now. For those of you tuning in for the first time, my name is Melissa. I'm an owner and head designer of GraysonLace.com, a women's apparel company that creates our own apparel, women's apparel, to help you look good and feel good. We are known for how soft, comfortable our pieces are. So we have a sale going on today, which is what we wanted to talk about first. We have our great um, gift. Sales. So we've got stocking stuffer items as low, you guys, the sale has items as low as like four bucks. So you can find anything for anyone in your price range for gifting. Um, we have cozy gifts, like the, like our bamboo is on sale at 77, now 44 bucks for bamboo. Those of you tuning in, most of you tuning in, listening to this, uh, know the luxury of bamboo. We have one size gifts. If you're looking to gift anyone that you're like, oh, I'm not sure on their size, but I want to give them grace and lace. We have one size gift category. So all of this is on our site. You can click on the category. We've sorted that for you to help you with purchasing. And the discount is as applied. And then this is, this is on sale. <laughs> it's a best sell. Apparently we have a best sellers category. Um, oh my gosh, you guys, I was just reminding myself how freaking soft this is. Actually needed jackets here like a couple of days ago. So um, our, our Sherpa jackets, corded Sherpa jackets are highlighted, bestsellers. Those of you who like the wrap-ups, this is one of my favorite travel pieces. Just wore this, um, the black version of this. So these are on sale for 42. So if you still have people that you're gifting or looking for gifts for or looking to get gift yourself. Or if anyone doesn't know, you have that family member that's like, I drew your name. I don't know what to get you. Um, you could say, actually, I can get it for myself. It's on sale. <laughs> I can get it on myself. It's on sale. Okay. So that is going on right now. And then we had a couple of things trickle in. We're still waiting on like one item um, that was supposed to be here for Black Friday. It was supposed to be a Black Friday thing that still has not made it in. So these are the couple of things that we're going to talk about today. Um, that were actually supposed to be in a lot earlier, but are here now. So we're launching them to you now. We're actually gonna start with, what am I talking about first? Oh, my earrings. Okay, yes, nobody saw, I was keeping my earrings. I have, um, it looks like I have two different colored earrings on, right? So we're gonna start, these are our reversible huggy earrings. I'm gonna show you actually, here, I can hold them up so you can see them better. So they are literally a two earring in one. It's half silver and half gold. So if you're that type of person, kind of like myself, where I'm like, if I'm gonna wear gold jewelry, I'm gonna wear gold jewelry. If I'm gonna wear silver jewelry, I'm gonna wear, I'm switch out my jewelry. Some people don't like to mix their metals, okay? That's very notable. Here is a way for traveling, for ease of switching out your metal colors. If you're someone like that, sometimes you want silver with your outfit, sometimes you want gold. One earring that gives you the ability to be silver or gold, essentially, by reversing it, okay? So here, I, I purposely put them on reversed so that you can literally see that one looks like my gold tones. Okay. You know, like I got my little gold chain on. Okay. The gold tones on this side and then the silver, I flipped it on the side to give that silver look. So literally like if you're like, this is, this is so great for packing and you know, like you want to switch your jewelry up or whatever. Um, you can do that with one earring. So all you do is literally reverse them. I'm going to take it off of here. 
so they have the little post and the click okay so they're kind of like this little i don't even know what you i, I don't i don't know like technical jewelry okay but the post just this just this just clicks in okay so you can choose your metal forward based on how you put the earring in okay so like this side where's my where's my gold side um you put your earring in like normal and then clip around the back and then for the silver side forward you just put your silver your your post here through the back side okay like this way and then clip it forward which is how i got i think i see okay is that my silver side why <laughs> yes okay and that's how so Honestly, you're just choosing which color side you, you have preference for based on your jewelry or based on what you're wearing. You know, sometimes you wanna wear something that has the gold tones, the warmer tones, or, you know, the silver tones. So it is, I'll just lift that up to you again. So it's that huggy style earring that allows for that reversible feature. So really cool, really handy, super great for packing and for the, you know, the flexibility to change up, like, like I said, if you want to wear the gold or want to wear the silver or just have a personal preference on your your metal color there you go okay so this is another item this is something that's great for gifting this is something that's something like you know stocking stuffer or whatever or an in-law or someone that you would be that would really find this like oh wow that's really cool it's two in one and i think the best thing about it you guys is it's like not even 20 bucks okay so super easy to wear easy to cl click close clicks on and then I'm just showing you both, both colors, both sides. Okay, let's move on to the garment bags are back. We have been, so we added a new size as well. So you guys know, we came out with our gar garment bags, I don't know, a couple years ago now. And honestly, you guys, these are the best garment bags out there because we use a super, super fine mesh, okay? But it's, a, we, we, so here's the thing. Garment bags can actually, some garment bags can actually aid in ruining your clothing, okay? Because it's important that the mesh is a very, very fine mesh, okay? You actually don't want a lot of open holes. If you put a t-shirt in a mesh bag that has a lot of really open holes, it actually can cause agitation on your garment and actually aid in destroying it instead of protecting it, okay? So ours is a very, very fine, soft mesh. We have the little zipper opening, okay? So you shove all your stuff in here. This is the large, this is the giant one, which I'm gonna show you in a second. And then it has our little tab closure here to keep this closed in the wash. When we were first creating those, I was like, you know what bugs me about the garment bag that I had from like, I don't know, Walmart, I had it probably for 20 years, is that it would keep unzipping, un I mean, unzipping in the wash. And so this way you just click your little, this little pull tab underneath here, and then you shove it underneath this little piece of elastic to keep it closed. Okay, so four sizes in this now. We used to only have three, so we have four now. We have the extra small, right? Is this called extra small? <laughs> I'm just gonna, yes. Okay, this is the smallest one. This is great for if you, um, the, in the past, we were using this a lot during COVID to wash masks, was perfect for that. But little things, okay? Like if you, um, well, we're gonna talk about that we just restocked. Um, our bra laws, okay, that would be perfect to put in here. Anything little that you're washing or need to wash and you don't want to get lost in your wash, whether it's delicate or not, you guys, I feel like, I'm, I'm gonna talk about my kids' socks in a second, tell you what I use for those, okay. Um, the little things, the really little things is great for this. And then the next size up is the small, which this is perfect for like, look what I have here, okay like a bralette, okay, just shove it in there, you know, some undies, whatever, maybe a pair of nylons or tights or something like that, your delicates, okay, small delicates, can you see kind of the size of this, I put that bra on there so you can see, and then medium is this one, and this is probably the most, like, general, this is my most used size, okay, this holds, like, I, I'm, t I'm tired, I don't like digging for my kids' socks, why do, why do wash machines and dryers eat socks? Can someone just answer that question for me, okay? Um, I actually have these in my kids, my kids' hamper. They have to put their socks in this bag. They put all of them in there. So when I go do the wash, all I have to do is take out their bag full of their socks, throw it in the wash with all their stuff, 
throw it, throw this whole thing with their socks in it in the dryer. I'm telling you guys, this is actually genius. Y'all need to do this, okay? You have, you don't have to dig for socks and find socks that match. They're all together, all in here. You open it up from the dryer, dump their socks out, match their socks, and you're done, okay? So. Um, this one can hold multiple things. This is the medium that can hold multiple things. So if you're looking at washing like several delicates, you can put a shirt in here. Let's see. Um, like this would do shirts, camis. You can even probably even do like one of our camis in this one. Actually, I can probably show you. Just so I know it's hard to tell sizes online. Oh, good. Others are saying they do that too. Okay. Um, it's hard to tell sizes online. So I thought this would kind of help you to show. Like here's one of our camis. Um, this can go in the medium, okay? So just to give you, just to give you kind of reference or like a t-shirt, okay? So that works just fine in the medium. The large is definitely can do a couple of multiple things depending on if you're someone who's like, hey, I need to shove stuff in there. And I know there's some of you who like wash everything in garment bags. Here's the, here's the other benefit of garment bags, you guys, is a lot of times denim, zippers, anything, definitely zippers, can actually get hung up on, snag, sweaters, things like that. So having them in a pr protective thing like this prevents the snagging, catching on stuff or whatever. I'm telling you, these will save, <laughs> garment bags will save your laundry life. Okay, and then we have this big giant one, which I don't think anyone even carries or makes this size. This is the large and it's, it is big and it can literally fit, let's see, it can fit, Okay, look at this. Here's our utility jacket. Okay, so a big chunky jacket, big puffer. You can do blankets in these, you guys. If you're worried, I do. I, um, my, I'm a big fan of cloud blankets, big fan of our bamboo blankets, okay? But I don't want them to get snagged in the wash. I don't want them to mix with zippers of my kids, who knows what, my son's football gear, okay, whatever <laughs> they can snag on. You can fit outerwear, puffer jackets. Look at that, It's that's in there. And that's that big jacket. That's our big utility jacket, okay? So this is one that's great for like puffer items or again, like if you have some maybe um, bulky sweaters, chunky sweaters, it can even fit. Here's our, <laughs> this is what I put in there, okay? Our bamboo blanket. It's nice and folded. That's not how mine are when I put them in, <laughs> them in here. But um, just to protect it so you're not snagging it. These ba Our bamboo blanket is not cheap. It is very, very nice, okay? And you do not want to snag it or get it snagged on stuff. So shove that in there and then look at that okay you still have it's got room to you know to wash and get clean um by putting them in there okay so all those sizes available we have them right now we do not have a bulk purchase option right now i know someone just said can i, can I get one of each size in the past we've done that but we kind of weren't able to mix with in inventory right now with that but you can kind of maybe assess best with what your needs are um for your own personal clothing but i think this one this giant one comes in handy oh you know the other thing i do you guys is i send this with my kids as their dirty clothes bag to camp okay it's not a dirty clothes bag but it works because then i can just throw it in the laundry when they get back so this one is giant it will hold lots of stuff and that's the largest size the smallest size the extra small is the previous one we kind of advertised with mask um for washing masks you can see that's massively different in size. And then with the other two, kind of like, you know, the large, um, which is super great and pa practical, or sorry, not, wait, large, no, medium, sorry. Um, you can kind of see the difference in sizing. I know that's hard to tell, so I thought that was great to run through. But again, you guys, if you wanna protect your grace and lace, if you wanna protect anything deli hit, if you're not used to washing in garment bags, start doing it. Your, your life actually will get a lot easier, okay? Jessica says, I have multiple large. I love, love, love. Use them for bamboo sweaters. Yes. In fact, um, this could, the bamboo that, like this big hooded one could, could go, um, would easily go in here. Um, so yeah, your sweaters, your bigger outerwear, your things like that, that's what you'll want in this bigger laundry one. Okay. Yay! So glad you guys, those are back for those of you who have, I know they've been out of stock in a lot of sizes and then adding that new size to really kind of separate out. Okay. All right. We are moving on. Ultimate denim jacket is back. You guys have been asking for the light wash, light mid, is it light mid or is it just mid? Light okay. Mid. What? Light mid. 
light, light midwash to be back for a really, really long time. I feel like we've heard that request on our VIP page. It like comes out in like every update that we have for requests on that page. I feel like it's always on there. So we finally brought that one back for you guys. Late a little bit, but that's okay. Denim jackets we worn year round, but this wash is perfect. Not too light, not too dark. And then the dark, is it dark mid? Is that the next one? Mm -hmm. The darker mid. Here you can see, okay, this one is back in extra large. Unfortunately, it is not back in all sizes, but we we saw we saw the ask for extra large back in this a long time ago. Unfortunately, this order and the shipment took forever. Um, but here you can see the two different colors. This is your real basic light mid. Here's your, your darker um, mid and not, not dark, dark. Like they're both, but they're definitely very different in color. Okay, let's bring, we have some people out in those. For those of you who aren't, familiar with our denim jacket. Is this Kylie in this one? Yes. Okay. Um, Kylie, you're in a small, right? Uh, this one's, I, I sized up so okay. that it could fit over, I could layer it. Over. Layer it up. So yeah. if you're between size and this, so I was about to just talk about sizing in this. So it is stretchy. Our, de our de ultimate denim jackets are made with our ultimate material. They are stretchy, but they're made to be a fitted design. So if you're in between sizes or plan to layer a lot, some people do size up in these, which is what Kylie just said that she did. She mm -hmm. sized up to a medium. So if you're planning to layer, that's where you might want to um, size up just for personal preference, okay? You are using stretch in this design. We intended it to fit kind of close to the body. So if you are going to layer, you might, or between sizes, you just kind of put that into consideration, okay? So I just put on the small. Small is what I've always worn in this. I like how it fits close to the body. I tend to feel like, you know, jackets, wider jackets aren't as flattering on me personally. So I like it to sit close, but this is a small and you can see I'm using stretch to like, I'm never going to button this. Like I'm never going to wear it button, I should say. So I prefer using the stretch, but here you go. Here's what makes this so great is look at the stretch. I see that. Look at that stretch in the material in the back that causes this to be comfortable and allow yourself to move. Where usually denim jackets are super, super restricting. Okay. If they're fitted. Okay. And then who's in this one? Okay, Carly's in this, and are you in large? Yes. Okay, she's in her normal size large. Do you feel like you would go up at all, like maybe for layering or anything? Uh, maybe for layering a little bit. But okay, she's I, I just like got a t-shirt. She's just got a t-shirt, so not heavy layering. Now I have like my standard tank underneath this. I have a couple layers and it is fitted and I am having to use the stretch. So yeah, just keep that in mind in your normal size or if you're between sizes like I am, go up. If not, and you know that this is kind of a year round thing that you're just kind of throw around t-shirts, make a cute outfit like this, then you probably wouldn't, wouldn't size up, okay? Penny is saying showing sold out in almost all sizes. Penny, it's probably showing sold out in the dark in this color. This shouldn't be showing sold out yet. We'll double check on that, okay? Um, Beth, yes, this is not the mid wash. This is the light mid. In fact, I don't know if I have one here to, to, to check the color on. So this is the lightest wash. This, this wash we did in the Ultimates we did man, probably maybe four year, four ish years ago. And you guys have asked for it to come, <laughs> come back since then. Now, when you first get it, I'm going to show you, I did seam rip my pockets. You, um, the pockets are going to be stitched closed. You will want to take a seam ripper or a scissors and open that up. We do that because I want to show you what I pulled out of this jacket. Okay. In the washing process, <laughs> um, they have to use these little moon, these moon rocks, these stones, uh, to actually create the washing effect and it's easy to get in the pockets. So we have them stitch them close to not get them in the pockets. One of my pockets, one of the sides of this pockets was um, not stitched all the way. So that was in there. <laughs> so consider it, uh, we've always just said like, why is there a stone in my pocket? You can consider it good luck. You can consider it a lucky find or something like that. Okay. So they are stitched closed, but they are functional. So make sure that you just use a seam ripper or just kind of get get your scissors and open that up a little bit, okay? And then it does have the inside interior cell phone pocket. So these pockets, you guys know on denim jackets are never very big, okay? They're just not, because usually these panels aren't very big. So you have that ability to have that hidden pocket in here to slide your phone in and keep it safe and upright, okay? So you don't have to worry about sitting and falling it down or whatever, okay? And then Michelle's in this one. Okay. And then she's in her normal size, extra large coat and, and extra large is the only size that restocked in this color. She's got the same color. She's the light one on too, but she, um, her size would be available in the extra large in the darker color as well. Okay. Okay. Any questions on these? 
Um, oh, Jane said I had some small ones in her olive jacket. You guys, I don't know. I feel like we should start a little thing to show us show us your little, <laughs> your, your rocks if you get them and we like have a little prize or something like that. This, I have never found this many. This is a lot. This is a lot. I feel like maybe it's like a super lucky day for me or something. Okay. Uh, Kalina says, my cloud puncher just arrived and came in the mail. I'm in love. Yes, you guys, the cloud, everything is really fabulous. So, okay. So if you have an ultimate, if you're an ultimate jacket fan, you know what size to get in this. It fits, both colors fit the same. Um, if you're between sizes, I would go up. I'm between an extra small and a small. I go up to the small and I still do have to use stretch in the small if I were to close this. So just keep that in mind. It is made to fit and sit nice and close to the body. And it's made for you to use that comfortable stretch. Okay. So those are the design intentions for this. If you know that you want, so a small in this, um, I have, like I said, I got that tank top and I have this sweater on, um, and I'm totally fine in this size. I would wear this size and, but I did size up from extra be between sizes. I went up to the small. Okay. Okay, any other questions on this? Can I try a medium? I don't know if we have a medium up here. You guys, we have so many staff in our warehouse right now. Uh, it is like madhouse. It is like Santa's workshop. <laughs> Santa's work workshop down there with all the seasonal staff that we hired. If we have a medium, the girls can hand it to me. If not, I'm just gonna go on and talk about the next um, ultimate denim jacket. What do I, uh, oh, shim, I get to talk about this one, Shimmer and Shine Pullover. We wanted, this is actually Amanda's design and Amanda pushed me so hard on this fabric because we loved this actually and truly for New Year's. We thought it was a really subtle way, maybe I should just hold one up to you, to um, bring in just a touch of shimmer, okay? It is not sequin, is not glitter, and in fact, it just offers that little bit. Can you can you even see? Okay, it's not intense, but it's just that little like upgraded element that feels like you're in just a comfy casual sweater or sweatshirt, but you're just elevated a little bit. So it's not like ref it's not highly reflective. It's not like multi like really shows the multicolor. Okay, but you can see in here that there are little little tiny. Lurex, I wonder if there's a way you can kind of kind of see. There's little multicolor lyrics in this charcoal gray sweatshirt type of fabric. Now, the the fabric is like a normal sweatshirt type. It's a loop terry on the inside. Okay, so you don't have the lurexy. You have like a, a nice sweatshirt or like a pullover. Okay, it's not the fuzzy, like warm, it's not like the cuddly sweatshirts, like your typical fuzzy sweatshirt. It's like a pullover in kind of just this casual sweatshirt type design. Okay, so you have that soft loop tear on the inside. You do not feel on the outside or the inside that, li that lyrics-y line because it's so micro. Okay, can you kind of see? Look at, you get like a little bit of blues and a little kind of peaches in there. It's just that subtle, like honestly, this that's why I love this outfit. I feel like I'm in a comfy sweatshirt, but it's elevated just a little bit, okay? So, and it's got your your trims, your contrast trims at the neck. Um, I would say this runs, as, this is a true to size design. We didn't intend for this to be oversized. I'm in the small, I probably could wear the extra small. I, in fact, I know I could wear it, but because it's not um, like over, like it's a pretty like casual, easy fit, not sloppy. Okay, just an easy fit. You can do like a little bit of a front tuck if you wanted to. I messed, I did something with my belt. I, I tried not to take the belt out because I didn't want to put it back through, so I tried to loop it back through. But a size small. So if, I, I would say if you're between sizes, I would go up. Um, if you want it to be more fitted in your between sizes, you could probably go down, okay? I know, I, they wanted to see me in the extra small. Is this an extra small? I knew that. I had a feeling I have an extra small for you, okay? Um, <coughs> Oh, good. And you guys are saying you can see the sparkles. Now, um, Kylie, are you in this? Kylie can come out when I'm putting that extra small on. And are you in small? Yes. Okay. And she's in a small. So you can see, it's just kind of like a classy, easy polo. Oh, that's so cute with the joggers. You've got the leather joggers. That's a great way to style a look. Like to actually, doesn't she look cool? Okay. <laughs> she's styled, like she's truly styled. So you can kind of dress this up, style this up as you want it, or it can be as simple of just throw it on with your favorite pair of jeans and sneakers, okay? So she's got the leather like joggers on, pair of sneakers, and then threw in that little kind of shimmery 
just touch of a little something. It doesn't even have to be holiday. <laughs> just touch of a little something that makes it a little bit different, okay? And she's in her normal size small. I put on extra small. You can kind of see. Thanks, Kylie. Mm -hmm. And um, you can see that I can wear this fine. I got slimmer through the sleeve, mm -hmm. not too tight, um, and slimmer, you know, slimmer through the whole body. Um, so I guess it just depends if you're between sizes, if you want it to look um, more fitted. <laughs> you or if you want it to look a little bit more sweatshirty so that is that I can the extra small the small just gives me a little bit more of a sweatshirt look where this maybe looks more like a fitted sweatshirt <laughs> that way but you guys know me I tend to like my pullovers and sweatshirts and stuff just a little bit more on the oversized side but I can wear the extra small fine okay and then Carly okay Carly's in normal size large yes right okay so easy to throw on and this is right insane just actually, this is what I was gonna have on before I changed into these, okay? Mm -hmm. She, um, just a pair of denim, has little slits in the knees, a pair of sneakers, and she has an outfit that feels like, you know, just an easy, cozy pullover, but she didn't really have to put much effort into. So it's really simple to either make it look like nicer or just kind of throw it on and be super cute, okay? Cindy says, <laughs> I need the small, extra small would be too fitted. Yeah, I think it's just a, it's just a matter of how you want it to fit if you're between sizes, or if you're someone that just likes, you know, some people go up like in regular sweatshirt brands, I have to go up to like large or even extra large sometimes to get them oversized if I want them. So I think going down to the extra small and it has stretch in that ribbed, you know, like all the, you know, the material itself does have stretch. I, I don't know if I said that, okay? So I feel like the extra small looks great. It looks like a, a classy look on me. It's not too short, nothing's too tight. <laughs> But going down makes it look a little bit more slimmer on me between sizes than going up and getting a little bit more oversized, okay? Marie, yes, it does have stretch. All the ribbing areas and the material itself has stretch. Marie, I think you'd probably like the extra small unless you want to want an oversized look. That's why I went up to the small to get it just a little bit more on the like true sweatshirt. I like my sweatshirts a little bit more oversized, but if you want it to look nice and classy, you know, cause I kind of got a classier look on. I've got like the boots, the little flare, waist high flares. So I would say like with a look like this, maybe going out to dinner or something like that, where you wanted it to look a little bit nicer. Um, if you like it fitting close to your body in between sizes, then go down. Okay, Jessica, I have the waist high flares on in a two. I sized down in these and I just didn't, I <laughs> see what I did with my belt. <laughs> I didn't want to pull it out. I didn't want to have to restring it through. So I literally just uh, sent it back through, but it has, it's the waist high flares. You can take the belt out. It's removable. You can use the belt as a bow if you want. Um, I didn't. So I just sent it, I sent it reverse back through uh, the, I just take, don't do what I did. Just, just take, just take it out if you don't, if you don't want it there. Okay. And then who else? Michelle, are you in this? Okay. Michelle's in her normal size, extra large and we're tweeting. Okay. Kind of the black on black, little bit of that, maybe new year's. I don't know. I'm not necessarily thinking of new year's, but I feel like I like to be comfy on new year's. But if you want to have a little bit of sparkle in your comfy, um, that's her normal size, extra large. Okay. Any questions on this? Jessica's in waist-high flares. Any questions on that? That, you guys, is that, oh, last thing. These were actually, um, came in early. We were trying to restock our bralas, which are our little solution. You guys know this if you've been watching us since last spring. These are our bra attachment solutions that cover your existing bra that allow you to wear your normal favorite everyday bra. <laughs> Um, but don't want a bra strap showing, you can clip these right onto your bra, cover your bra strap, and then if you have it off the shoulder, a wide shoulder top, or anything like that, you're able to still wear your favorite bra, not have to wear a strapless or whatever, um, and just have these like easy bra strap covers, okay? So black, ivory, or white, is this white? One of those two is one of those two, because we have ivory, we have my gosh okay wait hold on ivory there is also cream there's blush cream gray there we go white and ivory okay and those are 
you can kind of see there's like a subtle difference. On the body, this does it, it's just more, a little bit more, um, not as stand out-ish as the white, and then black. So those are back. Also, you guys, this is the type of fun thing for a stocking stuffer or a little gift, or if you do one of those like secret, favorite friend things exchange or whatever. This is a fun thing to put in because it's a really handy, fun, kind of like unique design. Um, and then Amanda kind of drew this cute little bra and showing um, showing the bra la, the strap going over your bra strap to hide that. Okay, you guys, that's it. So there is, there's one thing. And I think you guys saw it on me. I think I saw it um, because it was supposed to launch with um, Black Friday with our holiday releases. Um, our, our, um, slounge lounge sugar plum. I just, I don't know, something like that said, um, it's not here and I really don't want to pre-sell it because our shipping needs to keep up to the amazing speed it is, which by the way, you guys our fulfillment outside is making record numbers. We had record sales numbers and they are making record speed numbers at getting orders out, which is just insane. They're doing such a great job. So, um, I really didn't want to pre-sell it for you guys, but what I'm commitment that I'm making to you is that as soon as that dang thing gets in, um, I'm going to launch it. So it might be as early as like midnight. If it's early next week, mid next week, late next week, whenever it arrives, I'm launching it to you and we're going to get it to you <laughs> as quickly as possible because it's the coziest, lovely little set that really was supposed to be here a long time ago. So, um, so keep an eye out on our VIP page for the announcement of that when that goes up. Um, because uh, it wasn't here today and I really didn't want to pre-sell it to you guys. So, okay, any other questions? And that's it. Amanda said, are there any buffers? Uh, the reindeer tee should, oh, you guys, our buffer team, our buffers, um, yes, I think buffers listed, but there might be a subtraction buffer left. So what happens when we have a huge sale or anytime we have a sale, um, we have a manual audit process that happens um, to make sure that we don't oversell. Um, it's really solved a lot of that, especially when we have high traffic to the site. And so a manual process is needed to audit the inventory. Our audit team has been, we've had hundreds of products sell out over the last couple of sales. They are working their tails off to get caught up. When they are able to manually audit is when the additional buffered inventory is able to list online. So just keep an eye out. It's been happening every day. They're, they're refreshing and adding that inventory daily this week. Um, when they get through the audits, they're just working as fast as they can to audit all those, okay? Uh, Savannah says, do a VIP. We probably do. I feel like we announced a VIP. So if you don't, if you're not on our VIP page, our Grace and Lace VIPs, we do share a lot. We show sneak peeks. <laughs> so join us over there. We ask for your input or whatever. Oh, you guys, I don't know if there's a medium. I'll try to do a medium. Um, was there a medium jacket, denim jacket for me to put on? Um, Up here. What? No. No. Okay. I'll try to do that. I'll do that in my stories. I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, there's not one back here. Um, I'm sorry. I didn't put that on for you. I'll try to do that in my stories today. Okay. Um, Jody, I <laughs> know I gave it away. I said, there's one item. There's a set. It's a pajama lounge set. Someone post it. Someone who hears me and is a VIP <laughs> and has the sneak photos of that. Some of you, I know you guys caught photos of that. Um, post it again, I guess on the VIP page and then you guys can all see the sneak of it. It's a cute little purple, um, not little, it's a lounge slounge set, sleep lounge. And it's made out of this ribbed, fuzzy, like fuzzy ribbed material. It's cozy as heck. And it was supposed to be a Black Friday deal, um, pants and bottom thing exclusive. So, um, so they're all asking me question, what's the fabric like on the sugar? And we called it sugar plum. That's where they're like, where are you talking about sugar? The color is sugar plum. It's the perfect purple. And I'm gonna stop talking now. I'm gonna get in trouble, okay? Um, all right, so if you guys have size requests, will you guys hit over, just because I don't have them handy here, the team doesn't have those pulled. If you have size requests on me or anyone else, ask that on our VIP page. Um, and the team can get me to put that on in my story or um, try on for you there. Okay, signing off. Um, we'll see you when Sugar Plum comes. Okay, I know that for sure. Keep an eye out on our, our Facebook VIP page. That is where we will talk about Sugar Plum coming and when it's coming in. Okay. Oh, Laurel. Okay, I'm catching. Now they're all, they're like, Ollie asked me the other <laughs> questions. Um, the linen jacket is also an issue. <laughs> that was a very issue. Um, that one, we do hope that was a, a situation, a massive issue in transit issue and we have been told like it was lost and it was found and then it was not lost it's been a disaster so as soon as they can get that to us that's another one um if they can find it when they find it however <laughs> whenever we can launch that um hopefully hopefully 
um, that comes and we do. Okay. All right. Signing off. Have a happy rest of your week, well, weekend. And I will see you when Sugar Plum comes. Okay. <laughs> Bye-bye.